Monday we had arrived here and uh, that night uh, it was around 1.30 when I got up suddenly because uh, Christopher was shaking like a leaf. You know his whole head, uh, head was shaking and he was sh shivering like a leaf. His, uh, he suddenly developed this high fever. And um, the first thing that came to my mind is, uh, you know, when he gets sick, uh, we are very careful with him because he has this bronchial problem. And uh, we are, I'm, we are very, I'm extra careful with him. So the first thought that crossed my mind was his fever. He's got fever. If it doesn't subside, I'm taking him home. I'm booking a flight and I'm taking him home. Because I cannot, you know, I, I don't want to take any of his place and his concern. And uh, by morning, he was still, he still had the fever. So when the community joined together to pray at between 7.30 and 8, we had a meeting, I requested that they pray for Christopher. They joined together as a team. And God is so good, brothers and sisters. God worked initially. By the time I went back with breakfast for him, the fever had subsided. And I think by 12 o'clock, he was here, able to join us. And that's our God. So today I just thank God uh, because there's no one, we, we are just, we just come in place of God. Okay, we just come here to preach to you. But God does all the work. And all glory and all the belongs to Him and to Him alone. So I thank and praise God for this healing and for teaching, uh, for teaching me that with Him all things are possible. Praise God.